do this video. I'm doing this video. I'm trying to read my book, but let me pause from reading my book and do this video. I got a video that I want to make for y'all and uh, uh, it won't be, uh, have my phone ringing. Let me answer my phone. Hold on. Uh, okay. Hello. Yes. Uh, how are you? Good deal. Oh, um, hold on. Somebody's at my door. Hold on. Let me answer the door. Uh, I'll come to the door later. I got to do this video. Let me check my emails right quick. Uh, uh, Wow, just so much to do. <sighs> Don't master the art of distraction. What just happened with me is really how many people live their whole lives. They're just jumping here, jumping there, trying to handle this. Whatever fire burns the hottest, they run trying to put out the hottest fire. I want to suggest to you, don't master the art of distraction. Because what you do most, you will eventually do best. And if you live constantly distracted by every new fire, you will become a professional firefighter. But here's the problem. Stephen Covey says, that we ought not prioritize our schedules, we should schedule our priorities. So that's my simple word for you today. Phone rings, door knock, book, social media, but don't let them distract you from your priority. Don't prioritize your schedule Schedule your priorities for what you do most. You will eventually do best. And if you learn how to master focus, master concentration, then you'll do that best. But most people are masters of distraction. Don't prioritize your schedule. Schedule your priorities. I hope this brief illustration helps you see yourself and determine whether or not you're chasing the newest, hottest fire, whether you're reacting or being proactive 